What goes my name is Sam Withlock and welcome back to my channel. And as you can tell by the title, I've brought my dream camera, the Canon 80D. So I've been using this camera that you're seeing right now, the 500D, for about a year now. I've got it for Christmas last year. So it's almost been a year now because it's November time, it's always it's almost this is say it's been a year. I primarily wanted this camera that camera, sorry, um, for photography, but obviously recently I got into doing vlogging and these sort of videos I'm doing on my channel right now. And I realise it's not the best camera for recording at all. Um, it's more better for photography. All my pictures that I've taken for Instagram and so forth have been done with that camera. Um, but I think it was time to upgrade because if you haven't noticed that YouTube these days is not about the equipment that you use, whether it's expensive or non-expensive. Um, but it's actually the quality of videos. I know everyone can say that you can use the cheapest equipment ever and still produce some great videos. That may be true, but a lot of people like seeing a high quality videos and that's just how it is these days. So this has been my dream camera. I've fantasized having this Canon 80D for about half a year now. Um, I was gonna go for the 70D, but then I realized there was the 80D because um, I'm a stupid, I'm, I'm pretty stupid. Um, so I went for the 80D instead. Um, I'm not going to tell you how much it costs because if you want to see how much it costs you can just check it out for yourself and uh, you'll find out. Um, but yeah, I thought I was just invest in it, you know, I've always wanted it, I had my chance, I got it and it's here in my hands. So basically this video is going to be my transition from the 500D to the Canon 80D and you'll just see the difference um, as soon as it swaps over. So um, yeah, I'm going to swap over right now. So here we have it, it's the Canon 80D. I'm gonna keep looking at this screen right now, so I'm gonna just turn it that way, there we go. Here we have it, it's the Canon 80D, obviously a hell of a lot better than the 500D, obviously. But um, that I'm still gonna be using for photography, but obviously this is gonna be my main camera that I'm probably gonna take around everywhere when it comes to filming and photography. I haven't took many pictures with this camera yet, um, just because I've not really had anything to take pictures of. I'm more of a portrait sort of photographer, so I like to take pictures of someone <laughs> in a certain like scenery. Um, that's how I've always liked taking pictures. I can't take a picture of an item. I, it, it just, it, I just can't do it. Um, I haven't colour corrected it, so this is literally just plain footage. Um, so the colour is not the greatest because I actually went into the camera and changed the presets. Um, so the sharpness to the contrast, the saturation, it is down um, to negative one or two I think. So everything's just downshifted. So when it comes to post editing, I can colour correct a hell of a lot better. This room is not the greatest for when it comes to colour correcting because everything is just so white. Um, and white and black, that, that's basically it. Um, so whether this is going to look good with colour correction or not, I don't know. But uh, I am going to splice the, in the video now. Uh, to a colour corrected video and see what I can do. I know Thomas told me something about Magic Lantern that you can install on, install on um, SLR cameras like the Canon 80D and 700D, all that sort of stuff. Um, that can help when it comes to post uh, production, when it comes to uh, editing and stuff like that. Um, I don't particularly want to download Magic Lantern because they are possibilities of bricking the camera and I don't particularly want to brick the 80D because it's a, an expensive camera and I've only just got it. So if I can if this looks good as it is now then I'm gonna keep it as it is and just colour correct with it with it as it is now. Uh, the secondly the audio, I'm actually really impressed with the onboard audio that it, that the Canon 80D has got. Um, but I am gonna look into upgrading to an actual external microphone that I can plug into the Canon 80D just to make things a bit more better and when it comes to vlogging outside the wind reduction as well. Um, microphones will usually come with a, a wind muffler which will help a bunch when it comes to vlogging outside and stuff. But um, yes, this is the Canon 80D. Uh, this is not my full review yet because you know, I only got it yesterday and I've only had a, had a chance to play around with the settings and get it to the point where I like it. And uh, this is my first ever video, video that I'm recording with the Canon 80D. So I'm going to give it about a month because I know this month I'm going down to Cornwall for my brother's 30th and I know I'm going to be doing a lot of um, photography, short films and maybe some, a bit of vlogging here and there. So once November's done, uh, so I'm gonna say around about the start of early December, I'll probably get a full review of the Canon 80D with its features and just just good stuff for the Canon 80D. Small technical review of the Canon 80D, the transition from the 500D, 
and uh, I hope you enjoyed. Uh, I'm going to start making more videos now uh, on this channel. I did take a small break because obviously I, I just got a job doing social media and shit like that. And uh, it takes my Thursdays and my Saturdays and also I've got college all week as well. So it's sort of fucked with my schedule so I'm really tired all the time. But I see to getting into it now and I'm seeing to be gaining more energy. So I feel like I can just make some videos and just be motivated again. So there'll be definitely some videos coming out soon. If you want to check out my social medias, it'll be in the description. So my Instagram is going to be full of like photography that me and Tom have done, um, and my Twitter and I don't think I think my Facebook's in there. I don't think it is, but if it is, it's there. Go and follow them, Majizzle, and uh, subscribe. Hit the notification button to know when my videos come out because my videos at the moment are very spontaneous. I don't really have a schedule; they just come out whenever I have a video. Um, but yeah, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. See you later.